Hey everybody, how's it going? What is up? What is going on in your world? Well, today where I live, they are telling us that we are going to have a tornado warning until like 5 p.m. or something like that. And we might have severe thunderstorms until like 2 a.m. or something. And we're having all this crazy, weird weather. Um, I don't know if you can see any of it behind me. Let's see if I can get you some viewage. And so, I don't know if you've seen that or not. And it is really cloudy. So, that's probably a good sign for tornado watchage. Oh, let's show you this over here. And yeah, I could probably flip and use the other camera, but I don't want to stop this recording and flip over to the other camera so that I have to do this as I am doing this on my phone, and I don't want to have to edit this. And I get really close to my face, and nobody wants to see that because that's just you. Uh, and I'm trying to do this without editing and without having to do any color corrections or anything so this is another one of those wonderful phone videos i've been giving you guys a lot of here lately which probably drives you guys nuts i don't know so yeah we look like we're in to, for some severe weather and um, i'm hoping that sometime this week i'll be able to get out and test a couple um machete juniors i don't know what they're really called i think One's like a gator, and the other one's by uh, Gerber. Not Gerber, but uh, anyway, I have two machetes, and one's made by one company, and the other one's made by the other company, and it begins with a G, and I'm forgetting the name of it. I have several of their knives, and it isn't Gerber. Well, well, not at least the baby food company. So yeah, I'm hoping to get out in the woods around these apartments and uh, do a little testing or over at my parents' house, go into their woods and do a little chopping with those machetes because I've seen videos where the tang breaks or close to the braid, blade, blech, blade breaks. And I've used mine and I've done some chopping and stuff with mine and... I never had an issue, so I figure after this, I should give it a little bit of more of a chance to see what happens with it. I mean, they were pretty expensive at Walmart. It kind of makes me sad if they're going to break because I think the warranty's up on them. And um, I'll be upset. But anyway, that's my plan is to test out those blades, test out my uh, Black & Decker little chainsaw that works over battery power. I'm suspicious about battery powered operated chainsaws. Drills and such like that don't bother me. Now, skill saws or circular saws, that's another thing I have to say I'm not so content about because um, I don't know, I mean those kind of things seem to like the kind of things that you want to plug in. Now, I can understand their usage to carpenters and whatnot, but I don't know. Maybe it's just me. But anyway, I'm hoping to get a little shooting in. I had to call Morris, and Morris put a check on the modem, and we've been having dips, and these dips have been causing our phone service and our internet service to go a little hanky. So they're supposed to be sending out a technician Wednesday. And we've had them a year apart or so. Come out and check it. And the last guy came out and tightened up one of the the connectors inside the apartment. And said, oh, that was loose. And that needed to be tightened. And for a while, yeah, okay, it worked. But, I mean, it didn't work long. So I'm hoping to get that all straightened out this time. And um, hopefully we can get better service, the service that we're paying for. I mean, 
this is absolutely stupid to be paying for a service and having this kind of crappy activity. Shame on you, Morse. I mean, I know DirecTV has issues during cloudy, rainy days and everything because I have DirecTV from my parents and they absolutely love it. So for on really bad days when the signal goes out, of course, I guess nothing is perfect. But at any rate, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.